はい、アミヒロガワ。Uh, I wrote a poem. The title is Dear Ducks. Today is Tuesday, 18th July 2023. Let me begin this. I like to see ducks swimming in a pond, in a park. If I remember correctly, there are six children and their mother. A sign reads, There are, there are now only six baby ducks, ducklings, living, but we continue to treat them nicely. The number of baby ducks has decreased from seven to six. Therefore, the park manager put the sign up to calm park strollers like me down. I heard an old man told another that he couldn't see seven baby ducks, so it might have been killed by rain or a crow. That was a few months ago, just before the Japanese rainy season started. It tells me how hard it is to live as a duck in a park, even when the ecosystem is managed well by humans. Just merely continue living and surviving is hard enough for any humans or animals. About a month ago, I saw all the ducks, all the ducks in a pond swimming in their carefree manners. They swam to the stream like shallow part of the pond and began bathing them themselves, washing themselves, and preening themselves in the water. They looked fresh and cool in peace. Just having seen that scene only, I felt like joining them and doing the same. Those ducklings have been growing up so well that they were almost at the same size as their mother when I saw them last time. I wonder how child rearing has been like for the mother duck and if it is any different from humans. It might have been better for me if I had been born as a duck, not as a man, who can never live without tormenting his brain by useless and unnecessary thoughts. Life is vulnerable, as it is obvious from stories that people in the war zones tell others. Neither being born as a human or being born as an animal would guarantee my happiness. But one thing I'm sure of is that life ought to be enjoyed as long as one is allowed to live with whomever beside him or her, no matter if they are ducks, dogs, kind neighbors, friends or family members, brothers or sisters. See, the mother duck and her children, they are doing their best to bring harmony to this world in chaos. I want to see them prosper to cheer strollers like me or any other creatures up. They give me the reason to keep loving this world. Thank you so much, Dax. Bye. Thank you, everyone.